some people think that C-sections should be a choice given to women. But the problem is, about a decade ago, China had one of the world's highest C-section rates, with the World Health Organization saying that somewhere around 2008, nearly one in two babies were born through this procedure. Now, that's because after the one-child policy kicked in, lots of families started fretting about that only child they could have, and they would be overconscious. And also, C-sections were marketed as simple and painless procedures, which is not necessarily true. With all things being equal, unless there's a major medical emergency like the umbilical cord being, you know, wrapped around a fetus's neck, having a C-section would have a slightly higher risk for the mother as well as the fetus. And now, after the government eased the one-child policy starting in 2013, the government has also been pushing for women to go for natural birth. Because if you have a C-section, you would have a higher chance of having a ruptured uterus or other complications during a second birth. So attitudes have started to change and the National Family Planning Commission has also been pushing public hospitals to only go for a C-section in case of a medical emergency. So you can't really schedule a surgery like, say, in the United States. So in China, you can't just waltz into a hospital pregnant and say, hey, doc, I've decided that I want to deliver this child by cesarean. Not in a public hospital unless you have guanxi with the doctor. 